Some of us have done fun back to the side. Got a really quick Beyblade video I want to do it really quick. Lighting's looking really good. Camera's looking really good. Got the good, smooth, um, movement and stuff like that for me. Um, you guys are still going to be good, smooth, good. But yeah, um, back really quick Beyblade video. Probably not because it's been all day on this, but we did get some pretty good news. Um, for Beyblade Burst Surge, it's called Beyblade Burst Sparking. It has been translated to Beyblade, translated to Beyblade Burst, um, Surge for us over here in the US. So it is official. It's Sparking, just really called Surge. Um, we got some new news on that. We got some new rules for Bay has evolved and stuff like that. I haven't seen any of the anime yet, but again, I just kind of did. I did like literally like almost half of a day of just Bay Blade, like literally. Like for the anime and stuff like that. Like I literally bitch watched almost everything. So, um, again, um, hope it won't been too long with the video though. But yeah, um, sorry about the lighting and stuff like that. Oh, okay, now, okay, now I can't watch me. Okay, okay. Um, but yeah, um, we're like the current background where I usually have it, it just, I don't know, I got tired of it. But yeah, um, you see a lot of light, which is the background, I can't really help that, so, it doesn't really matter. But yeah, um, we got a new Lucifer Bay, here it's called the End Lucifer, like End Lucifer, whatever, um, I don't know how it could be with, um, structure or anything like that. It was teased in, I think, Hyperion, um, Volcano of Hyperion, Helios, and I think, um, Hyper Hyperion? I think that's, um, I, I, I don't know, I'm over it. Volcano Helios, I think, um, I can't remember the name. I just, I just had it in my head. Um, because I did a video for that. Again, I'm gonna try to upload this video as fast as I can. I bet you a lot of big like, videos like this, so I can try to get it out. But yeah, um, overall, this design looks really nice. So again, it was teasing, like, um, again, in the proper context, I don't know when I'm gonna upload these videos. But yeah, um, again, I'm gonna upload them in order, though, by the way. So yeah, um, oh, new no, doesn't matter because again, the same thing that the day it doesn't really matter. But yeah, Beyblade Bay 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 Burst Sparking is called Beyblade Burst Surge now. Again, in US stuff like that, so it's been officially translated. We don't know when it's gonna come out. I didn't want to say probably January and March because that's when Rise kind of came out, so we could speculate there. Because again, you know, the whole worldwide pandemic, crisis virus, I even want to pronounce it and stuff like that. You know, it probably delayed them off a little bit though. Even the theme song and stuff like that came out, react over it, did for my channel and stuff like that. I haven't uploaded the video at I'm recording yet. But again, all those videos, all those videos will be uploaded in order, by the way, so I don't have to spell down it. But yeah, I like the new rules for and it gives me a lot of um dusk like ball cash or um um Drip Bahamut um vibes for it though, because again those little ERN you know, like Hyperion and stuff like that. Um with Hugo and stuff like that, you already know how, you know, Lane's kind of being interested in him, because, you know, um, because Free Day actually remind, um, the get gets the vibes off of Hugo, um, um, having a rare vibe, since I mean, he's kind of like Lane, he had the same, like, you know, kind of vibe they got from Lane, so, yeah, um, of course, whether that's going to transform into Lane or something like that, but yeah, again, got a lot more of a dragon like vibe with the claw right there, got a lot of, um, he's Kerbex, um, El Drago vibes from that, um, I like how the gold and, like, you know, purple, you know, um, black, you know, um, teal or teal green, I don't know, nice and stuff like that. It looks really nice with the red, of course, so cool that's in there. I uh, look like it doesn't have the shield gimmick like it did before. It looks like it has more of a, it's like more of an attack type now. I think it's still defense, but I think it's more of an attack type now. It looks really, honestly, really nice though, honestly. It looks pretty good. Um, for what it is and stuff like that. Um, yeah, something's coming out, like, literally, like, before I was recording, the sun didn't come out. Now I want to start, that's what my hair up over here, too. My hair now never really wants to look good on camera. Never does. But yeah. Um, yeah, it looks like it's more of a attack type, but it has more some more attack um, stats right there because of the whole um, edgy right there. Um, but yeah, honestly though, it gives me a lot of like, because I have the old for pulled up. Again, a lot more of the face kind of did the same, so you know, part did the same. Because Sparking Chip doesn't really matter on this point because like, eh, it's kind of thing. Yeah, give me a lot of dusk or well, cash right here. Like, it's just a lot of similar design. Um, again, that's what kind of just reminded me of a little bit. Um, back to G a little bit. Yeah, um, it gave me a lot of those kind of vibes right there for me specifically. <laughs> yeah, um, I don't know what my hair is just doing this today, but yeah, um, like I said though, um, give me like a lot of those little bit of vibes and stuff like that. Again, I like the claws, like the whole, like, I guess I've always like some kind of like dragon behind me, like vibe. I kind of getting that from a little bit. Um, I don't know why, but yeah, but I got some more attacking fits up in his, um, a little bit more of his playset right here. Again, more of a good balance, and again, you know, like shoes and stuff like that, I have a really good balance type. But yeah, honestly though, um, it looks really good though, the pink, the pink. Purple, red, um, gold kind of thing, all they go with this for that game. Again, maybe it'll like change like his modes to like a dragon like creature because that's called, right? Um, again, this is like the third time he's evolved his base, so yeah, again, it's gonna evolve or you know, change made battle transformation. So, with that, get a lot of dope about from that. So, yeah, it should be coming up with Volcano, um, Helios or, um, Hy um, like Volcano Hyperion and, um, Hyper I can't even remember the name right now. I I, did, um, I had the video, I had the video done, but I can't remember the names for a life here right now, so yeah. Um, again, just kind of spring off on this again. I like the design, gives me a lot of dragon and, um, you know, just walk cash, you know, drip a homie pops, stuff like that. Um, again, overall, it looks really nice. I like the design of it, though. Again, purple, evil, you know, evil resonance, simple stuff. So yeah, um, again, 
And for Lucifer and stuff like that, again, they, they did remove this system, like where it has like the whole shield so why It is a defense type though, but they did remove the whole gimmick for it though, so it's completely new. Again, we don't know how it's gonna be though. It could be attack type, it could be defense type again. Um again, none of the enemy went up and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm not a car, but I'm recording yet. But yeah, it looks pretty good though, of course. But again, like literally like give me that same vibe right there. So yeah, it looks really nice to be coming out on the eleventh of um this month. It's I'm recording. Um, it's still November 2020, so it should be um, out by then, the, the, near the end of the month. They always tend to do this type of thing. But have bought, um, was it Volcano Hyperion and, um, um, or Volcano, like uh, Hyperion and Volcano were, um, Heli for the new Helios of like the Hyperion. I'm gonna say it like that. For the new, um, for the new base, because they did evolve. Um, they should be coming out all, all at the same time, because they can not around that time, too. So it's pretty good, though, there. Um, we got some more stuff right here, too. Um, for Beyblade Burst Sparking. Um, this is the official image for um, Glide Rock the Boys. First baby got it's called like Storm Strike, I think. Or Speed Storm. Storm Speed, one of the two. So yeah, I'm um, the main design for it. I know it's a little bit of white. Like, I can zoom in real quick. Um try to do that. Um overall the design looks not that bad. Again, the sticker of course is missing and stuff like that. So yeah, again they could easily like put paint on there again. Um I think it's like official now, probably like a Canada or whatever. Um I know it's like used to cover this type of thing for his videos so, though. Um no, uh, oh my gosh, another Beyblade tuber and you know Beyblade geeks and stuff like that. You know, everybody. Um, the big out the L. I can't remember his name for like me, <laughs> but watching is like, bro, we're, we're, we're here. But yeah. Um, also, um, again, let's, again, again, the, again, the base design stuff like that, so let's go for it. Um, to think of it. Um, again, like the stickers stuff like that. Of course, no paint and stuff like that. Fortunately, though, so it's going to look kind of naked. But overall, the design doesn't look that bad. Again, a lot of like clear, transparent light for um, Clay Rock before. Um, again, it's official and stuff like that, so we can we should be seeing that in the next couple of um, days. So like we should get more info and news. Again, I was gonna cover this in a whole separate video, but really it wasn't gonna be that long. It's like there's no point. But I just want to combine it both into one big video. But yeah, and also we got some more stuff right here as well. Um, yeah, speed strong. Okay, speed strong. That was called speed strike. Yeah, um, this how high period when we first saw it. Um, stuff like that. So that's how the box art is gonna be structured. It looks really nice though. For me, it looks really good, crystal clear. Hopefully, you, for you, I still look good. Again, unfortunately, we don't have the sparking launcher or have like sparks and stuff like that. Unfortunately, so again, they could make it separate though. Again, we don't know how it's gonna be structured yet. But actually, looks really nice though. Like again, a lot more like clear vibes off. Yeah, I actually do like it though. Again, it does come in three parts though, so or four parts technically because it's all on sparking ship and stuff like that. Again, it had the middle. I don't think it had the middle piece of sparking ship, even though it's just extra weight in there just to kill it. But yeah, you can customize this here and there and that and that. But yeah. I think we saw Brave Valtrek. I think he got leaked as well, but again, the image was kind of poor, so we couldn't see everything. I think it was kind of similar, again, more like similar to Japanese parting right here, which, which again, looks really nice. Again, a lot of like 4D vibes and stuff like that. Again, I'm going to buy the baby no matter what anyway, though, so again, we don't know when it's going to release. I think early next year, I think it's going to release at time recording. Um, again, I don't know when we'll this video. It could be the end of the month, could be the month they come out or something like that. But fortunately, though, even with Brave Valtrek, the early leaks when I went over that for uh, separate videos. Um, we did have the sparking launcher, so unfortunately though, it's not going to do the same thing here, unfortunately though, so yeah. Um, sorry about that though, but again, we already knew what's going to kind of happen, but it doesn't really matter though. I mean, again, it's kind of kind of keeping that sparking launcher, like, vibe from it. It looks really, actually really, really good though, honestly. Um, did I? Okay, I clicked on, I clicked on twice. Yeah, it's called Beyblade Burst Surge. That's what Beyblade Burst Sparking is going to be called and stuff like that for the, um, dub specifically. So yeah, again, it looks really nice though. Again, Glide Rock before they kept the kind of name and stuff like that. I don't know if they're going to make the other one where, you know, the other Glide Rock before, just in some different color. Again, they could do it in a two-pack, but again, look like, um, because I'm main Beyblade, you just do come in two packs. I'm not going to be sure. No, because I carry on and, um, Haley also going to probably come in one pack though. But yeah, look at the performance. Look like they're keeping the design the same though and stuff like that. Now that means the performance tip big and bulky like they did rise. Um, overall, it's not that bad though, honestly, though. Of course, you know, I have to blade and stuff like that, like I kept it main gimmicks, because again, it has been a good minute, so we've seen it walked before. I would rather recollect the sparking, but yeah. Although they don't have the sparking chip, because in the middle it has a big sparking chip, look like it's gonna be fused with it, we all know what's gonna happen. Again, nothing like really big about it, just like, yeah, you can switch out weights, stuff like that. They really kind of use of it. Of course, the chassis is gone, and now the chassis, unfortunately, though. Look like it's gonna be fused like it was with Rise, where we had like the, the we did have like the spring gimmick like, for, um, I know we didn't have the like, spring gimmick for, um, Dragon, because they kind of like it, kind of like that. We have the base one because they want, they, I think they want you to customize it with a frame, but I think because you know we had the whole charge and stuff like that. Um, we didn't have like the whole bottom part, like right here, where it had like the um sting and stuff like that. I think sting charge, I remember bouncing. We didn't have like the whole you know, spring like gimmick with this, so unfortunately, again, they wanted to sub that out because I think specifically, I know Baby Geeks went over, I think specifically, like Kirk Guys Fabian or something like that, they couldn't implement like the rubber. I they say because some certain parts don't work, like some of the attack archive parts don't work with Hasbro parts and vice versa, I think. So some of that stuff that they couldn't really implement it in. So yeah, I look like the um, the base design, of course, looks nice though. Again, some of the codes kind of do look not as good, but I mean, 
I don't know, maybe because of the image and stuff like that, but I mean, I can't say that because I don't want to say that. I can't. Well, I get the base product, it'll probably look a little bit better. Again, images and stuff like that. You already know I've read the most people's in one. Again, I'll probably go to below so you guys can see for yourself. Hope I don't forget because, again, I never kind of always kind of forget and stuff like that. And then it's like some of the stuff is kind of gone. I can't get any kind of back. So some of the things are kind of going to be kind of gone. Let's probably upload the video anyway, though. But yeah, overall, that looks really nice. Again, stamina and weight and stuff like that through the roof. I know it's going to be super heavy. That's the gimmick with the Beyblade. It's going to be super heavy. Oh, and how this game is going to be on the and stuff like that. I can't wait because, again, I've been kind of behind on Beyblade a little bit from behind and stuff like that. Uh, I haven't been out like that recently, though. So yeah. Um, yeah, for me though, um, again, that's also the structure and stuff like that. But yeah, um, for me, stuff like that looks good. Again, no chassis, you all kind of know what's going to happen anyway, but the weight is going to be, yeah, so, uh, okay. Oh, those going to have a metal in it. Heavy metal. Yeah, holy crap, so, all the babies have metal in it now? For this part? So, I look like they're good focusing more on metal again. Not plastic, because yeah, plastic is kind of like, because again, they, some parts don't work, some parts. Um, it was that bad. So, yeah, I just noticed that it has metal in it. So, we're going to have metal parts in here again? Holy crap, so I guess going back kind of like the Switch Strike. Or basically had like metal and stuff like that. I know a lot of people were complaining about guys having it for that too. They could have the proof frame in it or something like that. Um, at the bottom, we could have their whole proof frame. They could have just had the rubber and stuff like that. You know how they did with Hades, had metal and plastic fused with it. Didn't go for about track to have we're back kind of switch strike right? method. But yeah, no um rocket ship in the middle. And what I was talking about is that um one of the four images of the rocket right here. The whole sparking ship is transparent right here. Um again more of like a little customization thing if you want to really want to get technical. I do have um, this information pulled up. I just think we zoom in a little bit more. Um, but yeah, um, like I said though, um, the whole middle and stuff like that has like a whole sparking chip right here. We got it because I'm not saying change it up a little bit for like extra weight parts, but yeah, again, no, I don't think no one really ever really kind of cared about that, but it's just a thing. Again, like when we get the next Beyblade series, when this one's over, sparking's officially over, we're going to get like the next series, we're going to see like next teaser where we're going to see, because you know, last time we had the sparking chip, um, before that we had like the gachi, um, the extra weight and stuff like that. So yeah, it looks like the um, main part right here for the, um, um, energy layer, um, or, um, you know, energy, um, the yeah, angular and stuff like that, um, seems like that's gonna be kind of implemented right here, but it's gonna be kind of fused in with the chassis a little bit. Seems like that it's gonna be in there for the extra weight and stuff like that. Move this over. So, yeah, look, it's gonna be kind of in center with the extra weight and stuff like that, because again, it's really metal and stuff like that, again, so I guess kind of going back to this. Again, it's gonna be extra heavy, heavy metal, so again, some of the valves gonna be really more intense. Um, yeah, because, um, Attack of Trauma didn't have it. You had the whole, like, you know, um, it was energy layer, um, Layer disc, uh, disc, the um, energy layer disc, and a pin step. Um, so yeah, like, um, these ones have a heavy metal in it and stuff like that, so that's gonna be really good for them. Um, like, again, no chassis, so unfortunately, the extra weight's gonna be kind of gone, but again, they're subbing that out for, um, they're subbing that part out for, um, there's something that part out for like the heavy metal performance tip. So yeah, again, it's gonna be super heavy. Like this base is gonna be super heavy. Again, we haven't seen Valtrek, we haven't seen um Satoon, we haven't seen Hyperion, um, Helios, we haven't seen them at all yet. But yeah, I'm gonna end the video here. Like I said though, um again, I can talk about this all day though, but I don't want to spend all day on it. Yeah, it's like the sparking ship is gonna be fused with it. So unfortunately I can't customize it though, because I did it with Rise, you know, we have like chips and stuff like that separate and blah 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 blah. But yeah, again, some cool stuff. So, yeah, it's gonna give you more heavy metal weight inside it more. So yeah, again, I guess it's gonna be super heavy with these gimmicks. So, I don't think that's bad, honestly, though. I mean, something that out, I, again, I can talk about this all day, though. But yeah, something that out, honestly, wouldn't be that bad. I mean, again, no, um, you're not gonna have like, you know, chats and stuff like that. We all know it's gonna be typical. But all though, it doesn't look that bad, honestly. It looks really amazing, it looks really good. Again, no stickers and stuff like that, typical, but again, they can paint on it again. We can see changes and stuff like that specifically for it. But yeah. Not that bad, honestly. Again, no sparking chip, no chassis, typical stuff. But they also got for a heavy metal weights. The performance tips, I guess, that's how it's going to be structured. You know how that was kind of an incoming for Beyblade. They kind of do it with these tips, all different. The chassis makes it a little bit heavier. I don't know how Hyperion, because it just has, Hyperion also has a different mode. It's left spinning Beyblade. It has different modes. So I don't know how that's going to be structured with Blade mode and stuff like that. I guess they're going to probably take that out in the dub, you know? I don't know how they're going to do that, though, because again, they have that's emoji and stuff like that. For, um, you know, um, Tempest Dragon. Oh my lord, hold on. Hey, yeah, like Tempest Dragon, like Infinite Achilles, surprising, like, oh my god, like, so many open possibilities. Again, Zero doesn't have that, like, many new characters, because it's going back to older characters, you know, Bludgeons and stuff like that, so yeah. Holy crap, we cannot wait for the dub to come out, like, I cannot wait, like, what they're gonna do and see and stuff like that, again, everything's gonna be completely different, we're gonna see some new stuff change and stuff like that, again, there's something other chassis and stuff like that for, like, extra weight and get, um, metal, like, for extra weight and metal in the product, which actually is really good, because I've been working playing about that, the battles weren't really intense, because the plastic, you know, wasn't really, like, that strong or whatever, um, with battles, so I say, again, there's something other that for, like, metal weights and stuff like that, so yeah, we got news for, and of course, um, we got the really big news, um, coming up for, um, um, 
brought um surge so that we got um, the squeeze film system again just swimming out metal um swimming out like you know kind of all that big main stuff with metal now like all the main games that have before chassis and stuff like that all that's gonna be kind of gone but they are swimming it out for more of a um heavyweight metal give me kind of like how um I think the whole idea of 4D system when it came up from Metal Fusion, we had like, you know, a different, like, we had like other oh, super heavy metal weights and stuff like that. So it's pretty, honestly, really good though. Yeah, gonna go ahead and do it here, like I said. Oh, really good stuff right here though. So yeah, see you guys later though. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, great life. Oh, could you, you know, we got new speed storm stuff. We got new Beyblade like, Spurt, Reverse, Surge stuff coming up. I'm really excited. Cannot freaking wait for this stuff to kind of come up. Didn't really miss, really didn't really spend, made to spend all day on the video though. But yeah, really good stuff, honestly though. So yeah, um, I like it though. I think it's pretty good. I'm just gonna a little bit. So yeah, all this stuff though is really good, really awesome, really nice. Again, I would love to see more of this feature. Of course, we got Lucifer coming up as well. Um, new end Lucifer could be like, no, Dragon Lucifer or something like that when they evolve, fully evolved spell swings and frogs. Yeah. All of this stuff, can't wait for Rise to surge. I'm really excited, really, really freaking excited to see all this stuff come up. So yeah, again, really excited, really excited to see what they're gonna do in the future. Rod Drix, I tune. Rocket Wars looking really good right now with the whole heavy metal weight and stuff like that, because that's how the chassis was and stuff like that. Having the extra metal weight, yeah, having the more intense battles. Uh, again, yeah, Bandai, they're. Uh, I Bandai on. Yeah, Hasbro, Bandai, or however you pronounce it. Or they're really good, honestly, though. You know, Bandai, me, Doki, and stuff like that. So yeah. See you guys later, though. Again, though. Peace out.